I know you can't tell us what was said in there, but um, Hamas is getting support from someone who is Iran complicit in this in any way. At the macro scale, Iran has clearly been funneling funds to Hamas, Hezbollah, and uh, Islamic jihadist groups throughout Syria, Iraq, and, and the broader Middle East and, and North Africa. Uh, there is, I think, no uh, indications as of right now that Iranian leadership were uh, directly puppeteering this attack. Um, but I would say this, that under the president's strong leadership over the last four days, the United States is offering full military and diplomatic support to Israel. It has positioned uh, a carrier strike group in the Eastern Mediterranean to, de to deter a second or third front opening up in Hezbollah or in the West Bank um, or from Iran itself. Uh, and he is uh, working to ensure the safety and recovery of American hostages. Did they say how many Americans are in Israel right now in the of the I'm not going to comment on those numbers, but I do have confidence in the administration and their ability to uh, ensure that Americans who are in Israel who want to leave are going to be able to. Should there be deeper U.S. military involvement, either in terms of evacuating those civilians or rescuing the hostages? I think it's likely that we're going to see uh, the, the administration use civilian uh, airlines to help people get out. There's a lot of requests to get to get out. I think we've got the ability on the commercial side to do that. Um, but clearly the, the strike group is there in the Eastern Mediterranean uh, to send a strong signal to Hezbollah and to Iran that opening up new fronts in this war uh, is unadvisable. Do they give you anything like they say this is going to be long and drawn out? Like, any sort of timeline that they're giving on how uh, this can I didn't hear any prognostication as to the, to the duration. I will say from my own read of the situation, though, uh, we have hard weeks ahead. Do you think the administration is being, being realistic about what the role of, of Iran in this incident was? Yes, well, I heard a hard-headed assessment of it. No, nobody is disputing at all that Iran is a puppeteer of terrorism in the Middle East. It's a question of uh, direct planning, engagement, involvement in this particular act, I think, is it's just, um, I think the reporting is unclear on that. Do you have any reaction to calls from some Republicans to expel Congresswoman to leave uh, from Congress over her comments on Israel and Hamas? I haven't heard that. I, I reject that. Members of Congress have full attitude uh, under our rules of the House and really under our political conventions as a country to voice all opinions, whether or not I agree with them. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you.